of God to witness the marriage of Kayla and Matthew, to surround them with our prayers and to share in their joy. The scriptures teach us that the bond and covenant of marriage is a gift of God, a holy mystery in which two become one flesh, an image of the union of Christ and the church. As this couple give themselves to each other today, we remember that at Cana in Galilee, our Savior, Jesus Christ, made the wedding feast a sign of God's reign of love. Let us enter, therefore, into this celebration, confident that through the Holy Spirit, Christ is present with us now. We pray that this couple may fulfill God's purpose for their whole lives.
Pray together. Gracious God, always faithful in your love for us, we rejoice in your presence. You create love. You unite us in one human family. You offer your word and lead us in light. You open your loving arms and embrace us with strength. May the presence of Christ fill our hearts with new joy and make new the lives of your servants whose marriage we celebrate. Bless all creation through this sign of your love shown in the love of Kayla and Matthew for each other. May the power of your Holy Spirit sustain them and all of us in love that knows no end. Amen. The scripture comes from the first of the Corinthians letters, chapter 13, the first 13 verses, the only 13 verses, the famous love chapter. This is the model that God gives us to follow in our love for one another. If I speak in the tongues of mortals and of angels, but do not have love, I am a noisy gong or a clanging cymbal. And if I have prophetic powers and understand all mysteries and all knowledge, and if I have all faith so as to move mountains but do not have love, I am nothing. If I give away all my possessions and if I hand over my body so that I may boast but do not have love, I gain nothing. Love is patient and kind. Love is not envious or boastful or arrogant or rude. Love does not insist upon its own way. It is not irritable or resentful. It does not rejoice in wrongdoing, but rejoices in the truth. Love bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. Love never ends. 